Hi, this is Nancy Brom. Let's talk about average versus median. These are the two types of pricing that you see statistics on all the time in real estate. So what does it actually mean and which carries more weight? Let's go back to fifth grade math. Average is the total volume divided by the number of sales. So here we have five sales that equal a million four. We divide that by five and we come up with the average of 285,000. For median, you take the same numbers, it's the exact middle number in a series. If we look at both of those side by side, you can see the average is 285 and the median is 175. But if you look at the column of numbers, most of the sales were under 200,000. We've just got this one big sale for 800,000 that skews it. So in this case, the median would be a better indication of where the buyers are buying. Let's look at this for commercial. If you look at all these numbers on the right, um, the top three sales, 700, 880, and 1.7, the rest of them are 270 under. If you add them together, the average is 329,300. The median is 164. Now, considering nine of these are under 270, the average really isn't very indicative of the market. So I tend to weight the median price a little bit more than the average. Remember, we're supposed to take dead center for the median. If, there, if it's not, if it's two numbers, you take those two and average them. This is Nancy Brom with a mini lesson on average versus median. You can search for all homes in Bellingham and Whatcom County at homesinbellingham.com. Hope to talk to you soon.